Okay, and on to the next question. Uh, dear Mustiaki, before asking my real question, I have a personal one for you. Where are you from? Every time I see your name, I remember the Arabic name Mustafa. Smiley. Real question. What are the sins for manga stories like? This stuff is something that would definitely flop. Kind regards, Fikret Turkish. Turkish. Merhaba. Uh, Nasasın. Uh, I have a Turkish wife, uh, so uh, I uh, understand a bit of Turkish. I uh, I know a few words, and I'm trying to uh, <laughs> trying to learn uh, my my Turkish. Uh, but I'm not Turkish myself. I'm uh, from the Netherlands, like I said in this uh, mailbag show. I'm from Holland, and my background is that my father is Indonesian and my mother is uh, from the Netherlands. So I'm half. I'm a half blood. Um, and yeah, my the name. Uh, well, it's it's Mustayaki is uh, is my pen name. So I combined my name but Musta is uh, is is, uh, is a part of my last name and that's uh, from Indonesian yeah my my father uh, that's my father's uh, what's well, actually my father's first name um, a part of my father's first name and uh, when he came over here to to the Netherlands he uh, changed his name uh, his first name and he made his first name he had his last name uh, so I carry his last name as my last name and now it's getting too complicated for you guys to understand and I don't even understand it myself so um, on to the question uh, it, uh, what would definitely flop uh, yeah there are a couple of things um, copy, copy other work, copy other manga. That will definitely flop. If you, I, I, uh, when I was studying my for my own manga, I came up, uh, I, I bumped into an article where somebody from the states, uh, it was a son of a somebody, and I, not a very known celebrity or something, but maybe from a governor or I don't, I'm not sure, I'm not quite sure, but uh, that artist. That guy, uh, he copied almost the entire character uh, from Bleach, and I lost his name. I'm not really, really good in uh, the names of, of, of the Bleach. I know Ichigo, and, but it's that's a crazy guy, you know, with all the spikes. That uh, commander that's in charge of one of the leaders in that uh, kingdom over there, uh, with an eye patch. Ah, got his name. Uh, but you can leave it in the comment section. It's it that guy, um, yeah. That it's that guy he copied almost exactly uh, his 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 physical appearance, but also his his poses and some of the well, he actually images from 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 Bleach he copied this for his own manga, and that's oh man, that's that's oh that's so wrong. That's so wrong. You can't. You can't do that. That's a ripoff. And he sold his book. He made a total book, and I, I probably made it full colored. And he he got a book printed, and he sold the book. And uh, a lot of uh, a lot of people and a lot of fans, uh, they 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 knew. They uh, they found out that he copied it and it wasn't good for him it, uh, I, I've never heard of him since but that's uh, that's a no-go you, you can do that you can't copy the exact same thing that's already there uh, not only for yourself but also the respect for the other artist and and the respect for the fans you can you just can't do that uh, so copy is one uh, and the second thing is cliche cliche man um, you do not want to be predictable you do not want to uh, to go into something where the readers already know what is coming, and it really is irritating to read something that you already know where it's going. That it's so transparent. That there's no depth. There's no detail in that stuff. There's no uh, that it, it's so uh, out of the book. You just copied. Uh, storylines and and other stuff and and made it your own or made it your own you just blended together and and did it and it all has to do with um, well n not having knowledge 
of how to build stories, how to make structures with your stories. And that's something you really have to, uh, to pay attention on. Um, so it really comes down what a pro, the difference between pro and an amateur. The pro artist really has a lot of details in his work. He really does research to his world, creates his own unique world and um, have a lot of research. Um, and, and, and they do not have to be research about things that already exist. You know, if, if you make something unique, you always put a new element to it. If I take Naruto, just, just the, the creator of Naruto, he had a world about ninjas, but it's a world that's never been created before. And we've never seen it in that kind of way. Um, just to have people go poof and, and just a tree log appears and falls down with shuriken in it. And uh, it really has to do with all these all these signs, all these uh, the hand signatures just to create a technique. Those things are real. Those, uh, those techniques, those, those finger signs, always got the boar and the horse and, and all that kind of stuff. He did research about uh, all those techniques and how ninjas move and, and, um, and also the, the backstory behind ninjas that they're uh, almost assassins and they don't um, interact with friendship, you know, that they have a tough life and, and they just do their job. Uh, so all those research that he did for ninjas uh, he, 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 he put that on the side and then just created a, a totally different story next to that and try, try to blend it in there something in, in there somewhere just to, to make a new world uh, for himself and, and, and something unique and that's something you have to do if you're, uh, if you're making your own story if you just copy it from other manga you just see what you get and I see a lot a lot of manga also on inkblazers.com or all the online publishing uh, platforms where you can create your own account and you can read it for free you see a lot of ripoffs you see a lot of uh, uh, manga uh, that, that's, that's being copied you know, if it's Naruto or Dragon Balls, Bleach, One Piece, they copy the style, they copy characters, they copy clothing, they, you know, environments and all that stuff. And that's also a no-go. If you really want to have a success, and I'm talking about, if, if it's just your hobby, it's totally okay. You got a you gotta fan manga, you got fan art, and that's pretty, that, that's okay, you know, that's, uh, that only builds the success of the manga uh, that's already out there. Uh, but if you really want to make success with your own manga, you cannot create or copy uh, just manga that's already out there. That, that won't be a success. And everybody knows that everybody, you know, the moment you see it, the moment you read further, you know it's, uh, you know when it's, uh, it's original, you know it's fresh, you know it's something new, you know it's interesting, and that's what you want. So no copy and no cliche. That's uh, that's really a no go. Uh, and also another thing, but that's a, a, a more of a minor point. And then we go into really technical stuff. And it's progress. You know, it's if you don't have progress in your story, uh, it it will it will fall flat eventually. You need progress just to keep it forward, just to keep the story going. Uh, but I do not want to go to into that story element too much because it's really well a big world just to create a story uh, but you need progress in your story as well so if you don't have progress and things just ha consist out of battles or just consist out of just exist exist exist, exist why can I say it <laughs> existing wow I don't know I'm it's getting uh, well the videos getting quite long as well I'll try to wrap it up real quick, guys. Uh, but if you're just doing that, it's also no go. If you like this video, then super smash that like button. And don't forget to subscribe to our How to Bam YouTube channel. It's a great way for staying updated for the latest shows and videos. If you also have a question about making manga that you want to be answered on our show, then send in your email to info at howtobam.com. Also, don't forget to check us out on Facebook and Twitter for some great giveaways and prizes.